Paramati, 290 kilometers away from Mumbai, this sprawling rural urban spread has been put on the national map by its most famous son, politician, NCP chief and Union Agriculture Minister Sharad Pawar. This year, though, Sharad Pawar is not going to be representing Baramati in the Lok Sabha. Instead, he's passed the mantle on to his daughter, Supriya Sule. On Beautiful People this week, we are going to get a chance to meet Supriya Sule. There is a sense of expectation at Katewadi. The village is all dressed up and out to welcome the person who plans to be its new voice. For Supriya Sule, it's a homecoming of sorts. She has spent holidays in the region and claims an easy kinship with people here. But if she has to become a successful politician, that equation will have to change. The political capital she has inherited will have to make way for goodwill and respect that she has earned. But Supriya, who is in politics for the long haul, is in no hurry to make that happen. She knows every advantage comes in handy. While other MP hopefuls are still waiting for party tickets, she has already started crisscrossing her constituency. She keeps her message simple, invoking her father Sharad Pawar and cousin Ajit Pawar, Maharashtra's water resources minister, in speech after speech after speech. आणि दादांची कार्य करायची पद्धत आपल्या सगळ्यांना माहिती आहे दादांनी एखादी गोष्ट एखादं काम जेव्हा करायचं ते ठरवतात तेव्हा ते जोपर्यंत पूर्ण करत नाहीत तोपर्यंत दादा कधीच स्वस्त बसत नाही सगळ्यात मोठा प्रश्न जो महाराष्ट्राला आज भेडसावतोय तो म्हणजे विजेचा प्रश्न विजेच्या प्रश्नावर आमचे विरोधक आमच्यावर खूप टीका करतात आणि विरोधकांचं गेल्या सहा महिन्यातलं कुठलंही भाषण मी ऐकलं किंवा वाचलं तर त्यांचं म्हणणं असतं आम्हाला सत्ता द्या आम्ही दीड वर्षात तुम्हाला वीज देऊ मला त्यांना विचारायचं आहे दीड वर्षात कुठली वीज व तुमची तयार होते आम्हालाही सांगा मग आम्ही ते करू For now the strategy seems to be to keep it simple to keep all stakeholders happy and let the family legacy do the talking So Priya you've been at it for 2 months now what are the key things that you're hearing from people that's my first question Yes of course no well, I think people are very enthusiastic mm. I think the contribution which Mr Pawar has done and my elder brother Ajit Pawar has done they're all hands on here we have a great team here for the last 40 years and people are very excited they're very happy and what i really feel are their concerns is the requirements which have probably not been happen is the next generation i think some children want jobs they're looking for some scholarships so the more demand is for things like that i noted the fact that you said i am family and you don't have to ask anything to your family but you want to come and meet them uh, the question is that given the given the fact that this is from where mr pawar both your uh, father and your cousin have won different elections over the years um and this is seen as you know pocket borough a personal fiefdom call it what you will but the question is what are the challenges then for a person like you when you come contesting is delimitation in the new areas a challenge but really we have been working in most areas new areas we'll definitely have to put in but mr pawar and mr ajit pawar have always focused on a lot of issues they've never really restricted their their development to their constituencies they've always looked beyond the borders of their own constituencies always but i think the real focus for me challenge would be to try and match up to the expectations because they are both very hard working very committed the 24/7 available to people and Trust me, I don't want to sound because I'm family, but they've done a wonderful job. So, Priya, we're going to yes, let you yes, walk through the village a bit, and then uh... I don't think we are walking through the village. Let's do lunch and then go. Okay. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye bye. Tata, Tata, Rajan. That is lovely.